Hello researchers, how are you? I hope you are fine and doing well. In this video, I am going to demonstrate you how to install Magia 5 on Oracle VirtualBox. Now before we proceed with the installation part, let us first of all get ourselves aware regarding what is Magia, what is its features and what are its special enhancements in this Linux. If we taking the name of Magia, the Greek term Magia means enchantment, fascination, glamour, wizardry. Magia is regarded as the first Linux distribution where MariaDB replaced Oracle's MySQL. Now because we know that if we install Linux, Apache, MySQL and PHP, now it is being replaced by MariaDB. Magria is planned to be released on a 9th month release cycle with each release cycle to be supported for 2 cycles that is 18 months. The latest label release under Magia is release 5 which we are going to demonstrate in this video. So Magia was created in 2010 as a fork of Madria Linux by a group of former employees of Madria SA and several other developers and users and supporters of the Mandrivia community. If we talk of the Mandrivia, it is the latest initial release is 5 which was released on June 19, 2015 about 8 months ago and the initial release was on June 1, 2011 about 4 years ago. It is again open source, it is having RPM based package manager, it is available on Itanium32 and x86-64 platform, kernel is about monolithic and the default user type is KDE Plasma Desktop, Genome 3 Desktop and LXDE via CD. So you can see on the desktop of mine, I have already uh, opened the website that is magia.org slash en slash wife and if you want to download this, you can click on this download and you can download the classical installation, you can download about uh, live media, you can, you can have that is network installation. So uh, I have already downloaded version 5 on my desktop, you can see over here this is 5. So if I right click over here and click on properties, you can find it is about 1.20 GB. So you can say it is not a very heavy Linux to download. So let us start with the installation part. So let us open the Oracle VirtualBox and now let us click on new. So let us type the name that is Magia Linux 5. So it is Linux and version it is Mandrivia, it is defaultly being selected. So click on next. So I just uh, give about 2 GB of RAM because I'm having 8 GB of RAM in my laptop. So uh, 2 GB is sufficient for it. So let us click on create and VDA manager will be default, dynamically allocated again next. And now let me allocate about 25 GB of hard disk space to Magia Linux. So let us click on this button called create and now everything has been set up. You can see optical drive is empty so I will be providing the optical drive in just a moment. So let us click on start. So now it is demanding the ISO base so let us click on this browse button and go to my desktop and Magia. So click on start and now let us click on view and full screen mode. So now you can see the following option has come. So you can see a very good cool interface. So install Magia, rescue system, memory test, hardware detection tool. So I have to install Magia. So I have to go to the second option that is install Magia 5. So press enter. It is loading the kernel. And it is detecting the USB devices. So let me close this. So now you can see it has uh, come with the first interface that is choosing a language. So uh, what I do, I just click on this Asia and I go to, you can default options are there. You can uh, go to English, British English. So click on next. So I accept the license agreement. So I click on next again. So it is installing the driver of hard disk drive. So again the keyboard will be layout of UK keyboard, it is default, it is okay for me. So click on next. So because I'm having, uh, uh, you can say, whole of the disk, I want to spare it for Magia 5 Linux. So I click on this default option that is use free space. So if you have uh, knowledge about custom disk partitioning, if you're an advanced user, click on it. But I'm making the video for overall users, so you can just go with use free disk. So click on next. 
so now you can see it is formatting and it is making the swap partition so the following media has been found that is core release and non free release so i don't want to have any supplement media so i click on default that is none and click next so i click next again for media selection so you can see we have the workstation we have the server and we have the graphical environment so we are having the xfce workstation over there so if you want to configure the server you can click on any of the option but i will go with the default option so i click on next and now you can see that it has started installing and it will not take much time you can see that magia is a community we are growing all the time we make and use magia together so you can uh, if you are a good power user you are a good programmer you know about c you know about c++ python you can join this community and you can uh, contribute your own programming code with this magia linux so you can see that the time remaining is about 2 minutes so you can see the advertisement again that magia is easy to use with simple tools to set up and personalize your computer make it yours so we are making it ours so these four options that is language lessons partitioning and installing are known as the installation part and after that we are having the post installation in which we will be having the users summary updates and exit so again i can say that's a great desktop experience you can see what a cool wallpaper it was having you can click on this release notes and let's see what is happening so you can uh, click on anything and uh, you can find all the details all the very good documentation is being there and it also supports the latest bios that is uefi for 64 bit installations so everything is clear you can uh, have again you can say that rpm based is there so rpm based commands can be supported by this as supported by red hat linux also so various tools are there directory system and video drivers are also supported gnome lxde xfce so in this video i am going to demonstrate the xfce you can download the various parts also so about uh, less than a minute we require so magia is great for kids with educational games and toys for all ages writing and typing aids and more so you can say that magia is such a linux which is uh, supported by from a, a small kid to a elderly person everybody can use it for different purposes so i request you to do give it a shot after you see this video you can find how much stable it is and how much good it is So you can see that it is not taking much time it is very fast to install we are almost done yes we are done so now it is coming to post install configuration so now i have to set the root password i just set a default password with a strong password and if you want to change the icon you can just click on this icon you can see the colors are changing so i just type my name i type my name and i type my password okay so click next so it will provide the summary let's wait so it might take 1 minute or 2 depending on the speed of your system and all the settings which you have done so it is plug and play so i just click next and here you can configure the time zone so let us click on configure and as i'm living in india so i just click on asia and here i click on kolkata it is good for my country so the uh, the time has already been set out so click on next so again the default installs configure everything has been configured and everything looking fine so click on next so now it is installing the bootloader so i don't want to set up the uh, update media so i click no click next and reboot so after reboot we will be welcoming our magia linux 5 so server terminated successfully and let's wait for it to restart and yes so you can see that uh, uh, it is very fast so let us uh, boot magia 5 and press enter
very very fast what a cool interface it is space wallpaper so mouse has come and let me give the password and let me log in very fast so you can see that it is having the full uh, you can say resolution not like other Linux where we have to set the resolution it is defaultly been set so let us open the terminal and yes it is there let us have the IP address so command is not there so so this is the command so we can just type the file system it is same there over there click on Magia so all is there so you can see that lots and lots of options are there a file manager Firefox mm, panel screen saver terminal emulator so in office we have the orange calendar settings we have so under tools we are also having various tools so I can just type the ls command the date command let's try this apt get update let's see whether it is not it is not there so Ubuntu commands are not working so it is available on Linux cluster so you can click on this applications you can find install and remove software so I just give the password of root oh yes so it is finding the installed packages and you can uh, install any package of your graphics or anything what you whatever you want to see with this and uh, so in this video I have demonstrated how to install Magia 5 so do give it a shot it's a very good Linux very cool Linux based on Mandrivia very light also and very beautiful also so do give this a like to this video if you liked it thank you so much